Hey YouTube, um, I've decided to start vlogging. Isn't it exciting? Ooh. This is my first time, so be gentle. <laughs> oh, I'm leaving that in. Okay, now I know what I'm going to cover in this video has been done a load of times by other people, but I figure the more people getting this message out and kind of correcting this misunderstanding, the better. Now, the reason I want to do this video um, is that I've been talking to some people on YouTube and out here in the real world <laughs> about science and evolution in particular and one of the main rebuttals that I get regardless of how much evidence I kind of put forward is that evolution is only a theory. It is time for the hypothetical situation. Right, imagine you fall over and you break your arm and you have to go to hospital. Um, the doctor gives you a checkup and an x-ray and stuff and comes out and is like, well, I'm, I'm very sorry, but uh, you appear to have broken your radius. That's my doctor voice. So you sit there and you look at the doctor and you're like, no, that's impossible. As much as I know you've been to medical school and you've been a doctor for a while and you've got the x-ray right there and my arm really hurts and it's all swollen. There's sort of like a bump where the bone's sticking out. And the doctor's like, why is that impossible? And you're sort of like, well, I'm not a circle. Now I know that might sound silly, but I'm just trying to show that people in different areas use words in different ways. And the word theory in relation to science is used completely differently to how you'd use it in everyday language. Allow me to explain using my posh explainy voice. What most people would call a theory is similar to what scientists refer to as a hypothesis. You make a prediction based on experience and observation and then set out to test whether it's true or not. If enough people provide evidence supporting your hypothesis and it can't be disproven, it becomes a theory. So Darwin's theory of evolution by natural selection isn't a guess at anything. It's a solid foundation of evidence and observations built up over the last couple of centuries that all point to the fact that life has evolved. But, I mean, I'm not going to go into all the evidence now. There's not enough time in this video. I just wanted to keep this short and sweet. But that'll be one for another day. So... See you later. Right, so I'm making YouTube videos. My face is going to be on the internet. Huh. I wonder what my best side is. Should I have my hair up? Huh. Nah, down. I'm a lion, I'm a lion, I'm a lion, I'm a lion, I'm a lion. <laughs>